<sighs> Back on Lazarus. Let's do this. One of the main things that I want to do today is build a really cool automated base. And with that base, I basically want it to have automated lockers that fill up whenever I take a kit out. I want automated sorting of all of my loot so I can just run in the base depot and then run back out, continue PvP and whatnot. And I want automated smelters so I don't have to manually go through and smelt all my ore and all my other stuff, you know. And turrets. I'm just in turrets over there. I want turrets on my base. Those are the four main things that I want to get done. Oh, and by the way, only 25.4% of the people that watch these videos are actually subscribed. So um, if you're not and you watch this a lot, there's a subscribe button. Wow. Wow. That'll do. <laughs> Northern Outpost. Southern Outpost has a military airfield. That could be quite good. And we've got underwater labs and Arctic. So I'm thinking somewhere in N11, like on this mountaintop. Uh, I think that's going to be a really nice place to build. Where am I? Okay, I'm up here. All right, we've got a little bit of running to do. I'm going to collect some resources, put down some bags, and um, yeah, I'll meet you guys over there. Before, I just want to say a quick little thank you for everyone watching these videos. I really do appreciate it. And all the new subscribers we're getting, it's, it's pretty crazy. Thank you so much. Um, and uh, I will continue doing this as long as you guys keep enjoying it. <laughs> Lazarus is probably one of my favorite servers to play on. It's uh, such a unique experience compared to normal Rust. And I, I completely understand why you guys enjoy watching it. I really do. Anyway, enough rambling. Let's go. Oh, no. Ooh, okay. Oh, night vision goggles. Oh, love finding decayed bases. Thank you so much. Oh, a tier one. Can I get that? Oh, there's a... Uh, can I jump there? Uh, I can probably just build up. Or we could do a cool parkour jump. Yeah, we got the tier one. Nice. Uh, let me just hit a tree real quick. and We'll get a building plan and we'll, we'll go up there. What's it going to be? Oh, I'll take that any day of the week. Let's go. That's already kitted us out. Hell yeah, man. What a fantastic start. Oh, another decayed room. Someone obviously got there before me, but damn. Oh, I don't even know what to take. Uh, I'll take the green card. All right, cool. Let's keep going. Whoa, is this decayed? Was it all open? What the hell? I swear I saw it. Whoa. What is this, dude? Yo. What the hell? Bruh. 450 scrap. Um. Red card. It's all, it's all, oh, oh, oh. Yo. What is this place? What have I found? That's a lot of sulfur, my dude. Uh, I guess he just didn't want to play anymore. Um, auto turret. Windmill. Oh, nice. Garage door. Okay, I need to go and build a base before someone else snags this. I don't understand. Has he, like, left all his doors open? Oh. I need to go build a base. What is this, dude? I'm not going to lie. This mountaintop is looking delicious. I am very excited to build here. Right next to military airfield. That's going to be so nice. I know Bradley roams around there, so we might be able to even take Bradley a few times. That'll be huge. Oh, oh, look at this cliff. Look at it. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, I can't wait. Okay, let's build. Oh, it's so nice. Get a door on. Nice. Uh, craft a TC. I am cold. That's the problem. I am very cold. Um, I need some trousers. Can I make any trousers? I can. I'll make some trousers. That might help. Okay, tool cupboard. Uh, I kind of want to place that first. And then I can should be able to place this. There you go. Nice. All right. Okay, 
spaces of the king. Okay, what a what a what a fantastic start. What an amazing start. We already have a bunch of loot. That base down the hill, it kind of feels like I'm cheating. Honestly, that's like that's gonna have all the stuff I need to automate this base so quickly. That's crazy. Oh, what what a what a find. All right, let's go loot the rest of that stuff in that base. Oh man, I'm, that is honestly that is crazy. How lucky can you get? I think the one thing we're going to need to do really fast is set up some heaters. Because building in the snow is brutal when it turns nighttime. So I think that might be my first goal. Is to set up a couple of heaters in the base. Uh, and just make sure we're good. This base is crazy. Wait, I don't have... Wait, what? Oh, it's got to take this up. Pick that up. Pick that up. All the electronics. Thank you so very much. Look at this, dude. Oh, uh, we're going to be laughing. I've got to go back already. What's that? 248k sulfur. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> that is insane. I think we've already got most of the electronics. Uh, if I could set up the solar panels, which this guy has... Honestly, I, I feel like I've just skipped so much. <laughs> we might even be able to automate our furnaces by the morning. If I could grab that windmill, build up, place the windmill. <laughs> Honestly, nuts. We'll just replace the automation. There you go. <laughs> oh, this is so good, dude. Honestly, wow. Do I want to go this way or probably inwards, actually? All right, we've got the airlock. Very nice. Uh, what is... Do I even have heater? I do. It's only 200 metal frags. I love Lazarus, dude. I'm going to go waste 600 years farming scrap just for a heater. <laughs> I can craft it already. So good. Okay, the, the next step is power. Let's go continue looting stuff in that base. I'll take the tier two any day of the week. Oh, battery. Take that. Oh, red card. And blue card. Boy turret, large battery, windmill. Garage door, a high external gate, like all of the things that I need. <laughs> oh, dude. Honestly, it's like it was meant to be. Oh, I want these electric furnaces. Is there any space left in this satchel? No. Uh, okay, let's, let's head back before we uh, get too greedy. <laughs> oh, chopper's out. Oh, it's coming this way as well. Oh, that's not good. I need to take my gear off. If it comes any closer, I need to take my gear off. Oh, yeah, it's coming this way. Workbench level two. Nice one. I need to get this heater set up, like, a little very quickly because it is so cold in the snow. Let's go and farm some stone and a little bit of wood. Uh, how much do we have? Oh, we have a fair amount, actually. I need, we need wood. Let's go get some wood. And then we can upgrade the base um, and add a the wind turbine straight away. That's Getting that straight away is insane. 150 power. That's going to sort us completely. We don't need any more power. Do I have any cloth? I do not. Okay, let's go. I'm very low on health. This is not ideal. <laughs> Oh, warm me up. Oh, it's so cold. Okay, this is going to look a bit strange on a base this small. <laughs> but we're going to have to go and build up to place this wind turbine. Because um, we need power. Desperate to warm up and stuff. Okay, we've got away on the roof. Let's go straight up. Do we want two levels to this? We're gonna want two levels eventually, right? So should we build it? Let's build it in twig, and then we can upgrade it from there. Uh, 
Okay, before I place the windmill, I'm going to go and do a, uh, a big farm run. Just so we have enough stone to finish the base. Uh, let's go do that. I'd love some health as well. Alright, I think that's enough farm. Um, we got, I think, our 16k stone, so we should, in theory, be able to finish the base. And with the power set up, I think I might already start working on the automated furnaces system. Just so we have, like, unlimited sulfur and, like, uh, metal ready to go for when we're crafting explosions. Explosions later on. Explosives. <sighs> I did hear, like, a lot of gunfights over in the hospital, and I heard Bradley in the military airfield. And I've got to be careful. I did just realize that if I do eventually get a mini, I've got to be really careful because there's SAM sites in the military airfield. So if I'm flying home, it's going to be risky. All right, let's upgrade this bad boy and stick a uh, windmill at the top. Hell yeah. Okay, go grab the windmill. Oh yeah, how much power? 68. That's not great to be here. Uh, can I pick this up? I can't. All right, well, 68 power it is. It's not high enough from the floor, but you know, I'm happy with it. 68 was perfect for the amount we need. There we go, we have power. Uh, first thing we need to do is turn on the heater. Make some more branches. I can actually do the sorting system now, right? I could probably, uh, especially with the electric furnaces too. Let's just put up a bunch of electrical branches so we can sort this power out. There we go. We got we got heat. <laughs> Very nice. Uh, we need a couple of conveyors, which we can craft. Uh, we need a storage thing on our TC. So it's going to take all the ores and stuff out of the TC. Smelt them and then put them back. That's the plan. If I can... Can I place another one on here? Or is it just the one? I think it's... Oh, here we go. Two. Nice. Need a pipe tool. Okay, so let's do the auto smelting first. So pipe tool there. Du -du -du -du. Change the filter to ores. Sulfur. Metal. HQM. And wood. These have passed through, so you can literally just put power in, branch off four, and then plug it in, and then branch off, and then plug it into there. It'll power both of them. Uh, this one, we just take everything back. I might sort charcoal into a different box, actually, because charcoal can be annoying. Uh, so let's make a charcoal box. So that means we need a splitter, which I think we already have, right? Yeah. Can I put that there? Is it going to fit? Yeah. Okay, we've got the pipe tool. Okay, so pipe these up. You can daisy chain furnaces, which is just the most beautiful thing in the world. Industrial out. Let's go and put these bad boys into the splitter. And then out one goes to the this one. That'll go to the TC with like metal and sulfur. Should we make a sulfur box as well? Because we don't want our TC filled with sulfur, right? Yeah, let's make a couple boxes. We'll have a charcoal box and a sulfur box. All right, sulfur box can go up here. Yeah, we're going to have to do this a bit differently because of the uh, in inputs on the TC. We can't build directly there, you know what I mean? Storage container. So this will be sulfur. Let's change the color. Sulfur could be yellow. Let's change that to sulfur. So, in theory, this should already work. They take one power each, so we've branched off three. That should still, yeah. So, is that pumping it with sulfur? It is. All right. So, automatic sulfur is already done. Very cool. That didn't take long at all. Uh, I will, obviously, add the electric furnaces and stuff as well, so we can have maximum efficiency. Uh, we've got the heater. So, let's do the from the TC. Uh, let's make that red. Inputs can be red. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Okay, that'll bring metal and stuff back into the TC. Yep, it's already working. Oh, look at that. 
Oh, I made it. Now we just need the charcoal. So we'll do a charcoal box. Which will be... I think the charcoal box should probably be over here, to be honest. I might eventually move it upstairs. And set that to charcoal. And then we need to power it. So I will power it from... Alright, that should start filling up with charcoal now. Yeah, there we go. Cool. Okay, so our furnaces are completely automated. Very nice. So that will just cook away. Um, so we need to actually just go farm some stuff to actually power the furnaces. So I need my axe. The coolest thing now is I literally just run into my base like so and depot entering in my tc and it will just automatically get taken into the furnaces see and get put back into the tc ready to be smelted or like smelted such an awesome system i love it so much it's so easy to set up okay uh i need to put some doors on this base that is what i need to do okay when can i craft my first gun how much scrap do i need to tech tree down the semi-rifle is quite a lot isn't it like something like that is going to be 1675 scrap so what i'm thinking about doing is on this server you can convert cash into scrap so if i head to outpost and sell a bunch of stuff i might be able to convert that to scrap and then learn sar semi-rifle and then craft them and then go fighting with guns which would be so much nicer than crossbows oh i've messed up should have built this first well Time to take a freak down and rebuild. <laughs> Alright, all done. And now we have a garage door, which is nice. Good stuff. Okay, I'm going to bring some stuff to the outpost and recycle it or sell it and get some cash. I can't wait till we have guns, dude. There's an airdrop currently falling in Arctic Research. Oh. I am looking forward to having guns. <laughs> There's going to be a lot of stuff we can do. It's going to open up a lot of opportunity, I think. So what we're looking for is the poker vendor. Uh, he, you can sell scrap to him. Uh, you can sell cash to him for scrap and the other way around as well. So he basically can convert scrap. I think it's a two to one ratio. So we might need a fair amount of cash to be able to do it. But let's just see what we've got in our ATM. Uh, where's my ATM? There it is. 2300. I'm going to withdraw all of that. What up, Polar Bear? How you doing? Don't hurt me. What kind of stuff can we buy here? Oh, explosives. Uh, farm. Electrical. Okay, we can buy a bunch of stuff. Don't think this outpost actually has a poker, dude. Can we buy a car? I'd like to buy a car. Small combat car. 1500 Now, do we buy a car and drive to the other outpost? The other outpost is kind of far. It's this... Okay, let's go. Yeah, let's try to drive a car. It means we can explore the map a little bit as well. And having a car might be decent to get around. Who knows? I'd like to buy a car. Small car. 1500. Alright, did it work? Yeah, baby. How much low grade do you get? 50. Okay. Alright. Let's pounce. <laughs> Got a new whip. Let's go. Alright. I think we've made it. The Western Outpost. Nice. That was well quick. Ah. Nice parking. All right, we parked this up here at Western Outpost. Uh, let's hope there's a poker dude here. This one looks much bigger, so I'm pretty sure. Yeah, there you go, casino. That should have the poker guy. Let's go have a look. There used to be a dude standing here as well that gave you all your resource, your like rewards. I don't know what's going on. Phone, XP rewards. We have cash, twenty five hundred. Nice. Uh, I'd like to buy some scrap, please. I know I can sell scrap, but you I, you used to be able to buy it. I don't know why. The, uh, okay, so we looks like we can't buy scrap anymore. So we're going to have to do it the old-fashioned way and farm some scrap. Or we win a big on the gambling, uh, question mark? <laughs> I could give it a go. Why not? Let's go three. Let's go all in on three. Come on, baby. <laughs> give me the big win. Oh. No. Stop. No. <laughs> uh, okay, right. We're going to have to go and farm scrap to use the, 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 the normal way, all right? Let's drive home, uh, and we'll go and hit up a couple of the monuments. I might try and hit up military airfield. We do have cross... I can make revies, I think. Um, wait, can I just buy a gun? Oh, I'm VIP. I forgot. I could just buy a SAR. I want me to craft the ammo, though, will I? No, I haven't. Have I got a BP? I do have the, the a couple at home, though, so I could, in theory, research it if I get, like, 75 scrap. So let's buy a SAR. 
20 no, can I have got enough? Yes. Oh, it comes with ammo. Nice. So I've got no scrap on me at the moment. So if I go home and um, use the scrap that I have at home, I have 450 scrap at home. So we can easily research the 5-5. Five five. Craft 5-5 five five and then go do some monuments. Maybe even counter some of the things that are happening around the map. I'm looking for uh, low graves. What I'm looking for. Oh crap. Ooh. Drive. Ah. Made it home. What a nice time. That was a nice drive. It really wasn't. It was awful. <laughs> but it's daytime now, which is nice. How's my automated base getting on? Let's have a look. Okay, how much charcoal we got? Okay, the charcoal's stacking up. All right. How much sulfur we got? Sulfur's cooking. Nice. All right, dude. I went back to that other base and collected all the other um, furnaces. So we can probably start plugging those in as well. Storage adapters on all of them. Oh, I've run out of wood. Oh, yeah. Oh, you know what I can do? I can set a minimum. Only if there's a minimum of like 500 wood will it transfer any. So now it won't run out. It will keep 500 wood in the CC at all times. Okay, let's research 5-5. Five, five. Nice. Nice. So that means we can craft ammo and meds. Okay, I think we're ready for our first, like, roam to, like, do PvP. Maybe we just go around see if we can hear a raid. I'm very... T I, I like the fact that we can PvP now. That's what I want to do. I want to try and get some action going. We need to turn this SAR into multiple SARS. That's the idea. Do we drive around in our car until we hear something? Oh, raid. Where's that? I heard a satchel. Oh, my days. Whoa, my. <laughs> All right, let's go to the raid. I heard a satchel down this way. It sounded relatively close. Wow, look at that backwards walls on this thing. I have jackhammers at home. I literally could just backwards wall this, whatever this is. This could be loaded. Could be a loaded farm. I really don't know. Where's this airdrop going? It's something called a control zone on the map. I really don't know what that is. Is that where the airdrop's going? There is satchels over here. Where is that? They are raiding this farm. Someone's raiding this farm, but outpost is right here. If I shoot, it's going to kill me. We're in a hazzy. That's good. What? He's not even... What? He's wearing a paddle? What? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Where did he just... Why has he got a paddle? Wait. He's not dead. What? Three hits. On the side. Uh oh. Oh, does he live in this thing? If that if that's the case, we have a problem. <laughs> Did he get home? He's ready with a paddle? <laughs> well, I'm so confused. There's no way he lives in that. He wouldn't be running around with just a paddle if he lives in there, surely. He didn't even get any loot, really. <laughs> what the hell? Very confused right now. Let's go to this control zone. I have, that was that was a weird experience. I ain't got a clue what this control zone is. I guess we're gonna find out together. Is there anyone in there already? Every five minutes in this area, you will be given a random reward. What the hell? Scientists. Let's go on roof of the bank. I think that might be the best bet. I, I don't know what the reward's going to be. I've got no clue what the reward is going to be. I hope it's worth it. I just got points to use on the quest thing. This thing? 10 skill points. Uh, is that any good? Not really. <laughs> That's kind of bad. Uh, so I see why nobody's here. Like, <laughs> there's no point to coming to it. I was I expecting something decent, man. <laughs> Come on. Maybe we can just loot the town anyway while we're here. Wait, is that it? It's gone? I just got 10 skill points. 
That's terrible. All right, let's loot the town and dip. Man, the loot in here is terrible. Uh, let's just go. Let's move on. This, I don't think it's going to be worth it. Let's grab my horse and move on. I might help it up the um, the military airfield while we're down here. A cargo plane has crashed to E13. Should we go to that? I don't even know what that is, to be honest. Some of these bases around here are absolutely stacked. Like, they look very, very juicy. <laughs> okay, I think we're coming in close. Oh, I see explosions. Right next to a base. That's concerning. The, is it like a heli crash? A heli crate sort of thing? Uh, a little bit scared to push up, but whatever. Wait, I hear a mini. A mini taking off. Maybe we can make him crash. Ah. Did, he, did he get the crates, do you think? I did see stuff still burning. He definitely got the crates. That's unfortunate, man. Come on. Can't catch a break with the PvP stuff today, can we? We're almost too late. Uh, I need to get myself like a mini or something. Ooh, explosive crate. K5, where's that? Up there, abandoned mansion. That is kind of far. Let's go to that. Ah, uh, we're finally close. Okay, I know it's in there, so we got to be careful. He most likely be on the roof. Did I just see him? Is that a zombie? I think that's a zombie. No, that's a player. Is that a player? Yeah, that's definitely a player. That is definitely a player. I'm going to try and loop around to that hill. Oh, there's the crate. Oh, the crate's right there. Oh, that's perfect. That's actually perfect. Let's wait for it to be looted. What an, what an angle. Oh, hopefully he doesn't see us. Let's just wait. I'm scared that it's going to get night time and I won't be able to see. It's been unlocked. Okay, here we go. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, AK dude on the horse, bro. Okay, let's wait for him to loot it. Oh, it got me one shot. Let's go. He must have been low. Let's go. I didn't expect to get that. What the hell? One shot. Ain't no way this just happened. Ain't no way. We got to get out of this. What the? What the? What the? Fuck? Silence something. What the? Where from? Where from? Holy crap. I knew it was too easy. I knew it was too easy, bro. Alright, we're out of meds. Okay, what? The hell, man. Uh, I'm gonna head into military airfield to see what we can do. Pump, nice. Okay, it's like a convoy thing. Yeah, I see Bradley. Ow. Dead. All right, someone is raiding hard. Oh, Bradley's right there. Uh... Oh, that is not the kind of loot that I wanted. That's good, but it ain't bad. Uh, what? <laughs> it's good, but it ain't great. Is what I was trying to say. Oh, flamethrower! What the hell? Okay. Oh, it's the bank. 
What's this? Oh, it opens. Oh, fuck. Oh, it's underground. Okay, we're good. What is this place? What's that button do? What a... What did that do? <gasps> Let's go! Let's go! Oh, that's what we needed. Let's go. Nice. If I can get home, we can craft it. Uh, can I get out? I can. Okay, good. Alright, let's just go straight home. I swear my house is literally just right up here. We can research, research that straight away and craft them. That's going to be so nice to have. Research it straight away. That's going to be so good. I think the Scrap Town Bank is being robbed as well. Two sales coming up. All right, let's go scrap down bank. Pretty sure it's another like 15 minute crate in scrap town bank. So we got time to get there. I, I swear I saw the pop up saying that scrap town bank's being robbed. Maybe I'm going crazy. I guess we'll find out when we get there. Oh, they're calling in an airdrop as well. They literally don't care, do they? I think this might be that trio group. Now that I've researched Sarah, I don't really mind dying. Like, if I die again, I'm just going to go back to working on the base. Um, but I was trying to get that little bit of that PvP itch out of my system, you know? <laughs> you know how it is. So this is that. Okay, the airdrop's not a scrap town. That's good. That is a good thing. Okay, there's the roof camper, dude. Don't think he's online. These guys have silenced AK. If this is the guys doing it, they have silenced AK, which is just so hard to beat. <laughs> Okay, the bank. Where's the bank in this one? I think it's right in front of me. It's there, yeah. yeah. Well, if it is, they know we're here now. Someone's hacking it. I can hear it. Fucking hell, I made a jump. Okay, it's just unlocked. Oh, how do I get out? Silence AK. MGL. Oh. It's on the roof, I think. Killed him. Killed one anyway. Killed one. Holy. Oh, he's got all the loot. Uh, radiation, hello. Uh, we gotta go. Oh, fuck. He's the roof camper. Okay, we got the gold bar, that's fine. We gotta go, we gotta go. Let's ditch. Oh! Yep. Bro, he's throwing fucking grenades at me. Ah! Woo! How are we going to get out of here? There's fucking two of them in there. Oh, okay, we're safe in here for a minute. Oh, how are we going to get out? Um, we've got like 20,000 worth of money on us. Okay, we're safe. We're safe in here. Oh, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> so dead. I'm so dead. <laughs> They're probably going to bring grenades, right? That's probably the best play for them. Two versus one here. This is not good for me. I have to kill both of these if I want a chance of getting out of it. <sighs> what? What? Someone just got doinked. 
Is he on roof? Yeah, grenades. Fuck. <sighs> GG, man. GG. God damn. <laughs> I can't catch a break with this shit. I know exactly where they live. I know exactly where they live. Do I have a ladder? I do. Should we go and pay them a visit? Let's go pay them a visit. Pretty sure they got a turret on their base, but let's just go see what we can do. GG. GG. GG with the roof camping. Sad. But it is what it is. There's their base with the shiny uh, Christmas lights on the roof. There's the one. I want to see if they, I'm pretty sure they've got a turret on top, but I want to just have a little, have a little look just in case. I swear I saw a turret when I walked past earlier. Oh, it's probably in that. Yeah, hundred percent. I think he's running home. automatic nice I'm gonna get roof camp like hard yep now one sec uh, uh, uh. No. did he die he didn't die did he Okay, he's dead. Nice. He's got a turret though, so I've got to be careful. Can I get underneath that? Bolt? Oh, I should leave. Nice. Let's go. I'll take that bolt any day. Hell yeah, man. We got out with some gear. It's the first time. <laughs> All right. But this bolt is huge. Nice. It's got 8x. Oh, nice. Hell yeah, dude. We can clear scientists with this thing so nicely. You never silence or anything. No, it's kind of annoying. It shows how much he's been roof camping. Look at the damage on this gun. <laughs> how many times he's repaired it. <laughs> That's nuts. I think I'm going to work on my base for a bit. Uh, I need to farm some wood. I need to start crafting some wooden walls. Getting a little compound going. Ah, what a lovely farm run. That's actually kind of nice. So, uh, I can craft... I think I can craft high external wooden walls al already. Yeah, I can. So, how many can I make? Nine. Uh, should we just... Let's do eight for now. I don't know how many I actually need. I really should get these hooked up, shouldn't I? Uh, let's do that now. I need a... Uh, I just daisy chain them from these furnaces. So, where's the pipe tool? So, instead of going to the splitter from there... I'll go around here. And then in to you. And then you can go to the splitter. Oh, it's kind of messy. But that should be working. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, and then the output of that should... Yeah, it's just fine. So then we need to wire it up with some power. Uh, the thing with electrical furnaces is they haven't got a pass-through. So you have to do a branch for each one. Which is kind of a pain in the ass, but it is what it is. Do I have any more? I'd have to craft them. <laughs> One more, okay. Let's craft some more. Okay, and that should be moving, yeah, it's moving stuff out as well. Nice. All right, nice one. That was easy. <laughs> okay, let's go put this compound out. Okay, let's see. So I want the gate to be at the front. It's nice. Alright, one more wall and then we should have a compound. 
Okay, please fit. Oh, oh. You can't fit through there, can you? Nah, you can't fit through there. Alright, we got a secure compound. Nice. That was quite easy, actually. Not bad. Yeah, I think I need to work on uh, maybe adding a shooting floor and stuff as well in the future. Uh, we've got a little bit of stone. Quite a lot of metal. We won't be able to use the metal in the base until we upgrade the tool cupboard. So we have to upgrade the tool cupboard to using five grand in cash to be able to use metal. That's why all the bases around here with metal, they look like they're juicy. You know what I mean? Let's put this oil refinery outside. So if I grab all the sulfur and all the GP now, uh, all the charcoal, how much GP can we make? Two sulfur. How does this work? Input ingredients to two sulfur, two charcoal. Wait, what? This is all different. This is a different mixing table. So that should create like 400 GP. All right, so 2.1K for uh, GP. So we could probably make eight satchels to do a little raid. There's a couple bases around here that I would, wouldn't mind raiding. Can I set up lights in my base? Do I have the light BP? I do. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, this base is looking sick. <laughs> uh, should I craft bean cans? See how many we can get. 10, 20, 30? 35. Wow, okay. Don't think I've got... I haven't got cloth to make stashes. I really need to go kill some bears. Uh, I think I'm going to go do uh, a little Arctic research. I've got a blue card and a fuse. I'm going to take the Balti with me because why not? The problem is I don't actually have any cloth for meds. Which is kind of silly, really, isn't it? Um, let me. I've got a hatchet. Let me try and kill a bear on the way, maybe. I have the coldest hands in existence right now. I feel like I am playing Rust on the moon. Oh, my days. Um, if I do eventually do a raid, I'm, there's a little base down here, which I think I might raid. Um, I don't. They haven't really been active, but you know, it's a small base which we might be able to raid. Lives near Arctic, so I could have some loot. You know, this little thing. I reckon two sheet metal doors. Oh, maybe quite a few, actually. Ooh, Ooh don't know about that. Maybe ten, ten sacks on the back. We will see. We will see. I don't know. Let's go see what we get from Arctic research. All right. Here we go. Start clearing scientists. Do they drop in one shot? ourselves a snowmobile that's pretty cool that was not worth the blue slide <laughs> i mean not great but whatever it is what it is we got another red card as well that's pretty good all right, we looted everything. Let's get out of here. Oh, I'm going to recycle some of this one of these hazmats, actually, for cloth. So I can make um, uh, satchels. Oh, you need rope as well, don't you? I forget. Duh. That was a pretty decent haul, to be fair. Uh, yeah, nearly 100. Well, over 100 HQM. That's crazy. Nice one. Uh, I've got some cash as well. 450. 600 scrap. So, you know, we could research some stuff. Pretty good stuff. I want to get the auto turret set up in the base. I'd like to research the auto turret, actually. Because I do have a camera and a laptop, so I can craft one. Nice one. Oh, someone's raining. I'm going to go over that. It's like there. Yeah, right in front. Let's go. How many satchels? Damn. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's the bank. Someone's doing the bank? 
Damn, son. Okay. Uh, they're probably going to get on roof. That's what most people do, get on roof. They were, they were doing a HQM door with satchels? That is insane. I don't know how many meds. I have bought way too much ammo for this. God. Yeah, let's just try and see if we can see how many there are. Probably is more than one. Oh, they haven't got on roof. It takes 15 minutes to unlock the crate at the bank, so there's there's no point in me killing someone now. Well, unless they got like AK or something, but you know, a decent gun of gear. Yeah, that is the bank. Someone is raiding the bank, and if you do raid the bank successfully, you get a lot of cash. You get like 20, 30 grand. Oh, this one, I think you get like 40 grand. So I want to get into a good position because I feel like probably everyone's going to come here. Surprised they didn't get roof though. Uh, this is kind of a good position. they're not on roof, they're most likely just camping one of the sides. Oh. Get an AK. Let's go. Let's get our dodge. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> I'm going to try and get home somehow. Let's get out of here. I don't care about the crate right now. Do not care about the crate right now. He almost killed me, dude. Like, he was so close. What a beast set. Full AK, extended mag, flashlight. Yo. And it's kind of fully... It's not full, but it's like not bad. I will keep this inside until I have enough to research it. That is a beautiful thing to have. We've almost got too much loot already. Again. I think I'm going to go back for the crate. I don't know how long is going to be left on it, but... We can give it a go, eh? Why not? It's probably going to be... Well, I'm, I'm prepared to die now. I'm fine with dying now because I just want to go work on my base. So, if we lose the bolt, we lose the bolt. But we got an AK. So, I feel like that's a fair trade-off. There's nobody on the ridge, is there? Doesn't look like it. I'm so scared right now. <laughs> How long's left on the crate? Oh, it's done. Has it been looted? Oh my god, it hasn't been looted. Let's go. Let's get out of here. We're probably gonna die now. Oh, that's so much money on me right now. Ugh. Let's go. Let's go. I'm gonna run straight to the southern outpost. Oh, dude, that's a lot of money. If we can get this to the outpost and sell it, that's enough to like buy minis and do all kinds of stuff, dude. It's like 20 or... I think it's like 40 grand. Which is crazy. I'm waiting for that safe zone thing to pop up. Please, come on. Oh, come on, come on. Safe zone. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, oh I can relax. Oh. <laughs> Dude. Okay. Uh, let's go sell this stuff. I believe you have to sell it to the... Actually, it doesn't matter where you sell it. You sell it to anyone. Hello, sir. Sell. Uh, illegal goods. 48k! <laughs> Yo! And then the chains. 7k. 55 grand we got. What the hell? That is insane. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put some of this in my bank. Um, the problem is if you have all of it in your bank, I think you lose money every time that somebody robs the bank. But I don't know how much, so it might be worth me sticking some in the bank. Oh, I've my ra maximum capacity. Oh, shoot. What's my maximum? 3k, really? Uh, increase ATM. 
the 10,000. What level am I? Seven. Okay. So then we can get 10... We can put 10k in there. So 6,925. There you go. We've got 10 grand in the balance. I've got 48 grand <laughs> to play with. Um, can I? Is there an illegal goods seller here? I'm, in, am I, I'm interested in buying C4. I don't know if there is one at this outpost. Because this is like a really small one. Oh. Oh, okay. One C4 is 11k. So two C4. How much C4 is it for an armored door? I think it's... Is it two? Three. So it cost. So if it's going to cost me... 34 grand... To raid the bank again. And get another like 50 grand from it. So you can profit from raiding the banks. Like really quite quite well. But obviously there's that risk involved of people also raiding you. <laughs> I'm going to buy uh, three turrets. For nine grand. Let's buy a mini and fly home. And then we could upgrade our base to metal. Because we got enough to upgrade the TC. We could upgrade the furnaces. Oh so good. I'd like to buy a helicopter, please. Beautiful. Set up some of these auto turrets, I think. And then one in the compound, I think. Let's go upgrade our tool cupboard so we can get to metal. It costs five grand. Upgrade. Nice. So that means I think we can actually upgrade stuff to metal yeah nice let's make our tc room metal i might stick a turret in here just because why not like people might go through doors stick a turret in here just to really get on their nerves <laughs> just like, like that i could still get through nice and easily uh can we fill the yep we can fill the turrets with ours nice and i think we have enough power to do it 29 it's only two turrets that's a problem that is a problem we could have put out solar panels into a battery uh yeah we can craft so do we have any tech trash did i recycle it all i think i recycled it all mm, that is an issue wait 58 power i swear that was just huh okay it changed that's weird yeah, we've got enough of the turrets now. <laughs> Alright, so those turrets set up. The turret inside the base, looking good. Uh, I'm going to craft as many satchels as I can. I think we've got eight satchels. It's enough for two doors, right? Yeah, we've got eight satchels. So we could go raiding. Oh, we've run out of ore to smelt. <laughs> we've actually smelted everything. That's kind of impressive. Uh, I guess we go farming then before we raid. I mean, we do have a red car. We could do oil rig. I don't think I have enough meds for oil rig. We could chop up the scientists, I suppose. It's kind of risky, though. You know what? Screw it. Let's go. Holy crap, that's a big base. Oh, shit. Seem to be that many though, which is kind of strange. Oh, they're the one shot kill scientists. They're those ones. Oh, that's a heavy. What the fuck? Did I see a heavy? Am I going crazy? card room on Lazarus. Can't say I've ever done this before. Or I don't rem remember doing it. Uh, okay, what'd you get? Okay, not bad. Not bad. Pretty, pretty bad. Oh, a chainsaw. Oh, I actually need one of them. I do actually need one of them. Stone wall. I don't know if I need that. 
My question is, do we do the heavies? We, we don't really have an insane amount of meds. I think that's been answered for me. <laughs> Wait, is that all of them? I think that might be all of them. What kind of loot do you get on here? Uh, okay. A lot of shotgun shells. Just a lot of meds. A lot of meds. I'm not complaining about meds. That's pretty good. I like it. That was a good rig run. Let me, um... I don't step on the crate. Probably got five minutes, right? Two minutes. Nice. You're joking. What? Wait, I'm not dead. I am dead. Why did I die? What the hell? Why am I dead? What happened? <gasps> I stood up. There's no way. There's no way. How did I die? Uh, I had to answer the door. <laughs> but I'm alive. <laughs> What did I die to? I'm very confused right now. Okay. Ooh, explode. Nice. I have to answer the door. Like, I don't know what happened. I have to look at the footage. I haven't got a clue how I died. I'm so lucky. <laughs> Whoop! Alright. <laughs> wow. We got explo ammo. That's pretty cool. We need a tier 3, though. We must be getting close in scrap. I think someone's doing Arctic right now. We made it. Nice. If I had a bit of a bigger base, I would have done Chopper, but, you know. I'd love to do Chopper right now. I just don't think I can with this base. It'll blow up everything. It'll blow up my mini. It'll blow up... Let me move the mini. I don't care about the windmill. I've got another one. I don't think I can take Chopper in this base, but we're going to give it a go. Oh, I think it's going away. Oh, let's turn around. Wish me luck. Oh, they got it. Oh, man. I'm, I'm going to it. I'm going to it. Screw it, dude. It's right, right here. What the? They don't even have a... What is that base that they took it from? What the hell? What, a farm base? Did the crates go in the wall? Oh, it's dead. What the? Oh, it's dead. Oh, shit. Oh, this isn't good for me. Are you still there? It's dead. Oh, I'm scared of both of these bases. I got it out of here, dude. Oh, is it just ammo? <laughs> This is just an ammo freaking hell. You have a gun? MP5. What about that hazzy? Oh, this is a risky place to be, dude. This is a risky place to be. What's that? Oh. Sniper? What? What? Do these spawn with the. Huh? I swear I saw a hazmat suit on the floor. What? Am I going crazy? I am very confused. <laughs> Is this the base that took it? There's no way. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, okay, dude. Well, if they got C4 rockets, then they ran it in straight away. Fair play. 
Okay, I've made some additions to the base. We've got garage doors everywhere now. I've upgraded the upstairs. So we have a little bit more storage. It's going to be a garage door there. Uh, we've got the mixing table. Walled this off. We've got the upstairs like this. We've got the shooting floor, which is very basic, I know. Like 2019 rust, but whatever. It is what it is. Uh, I'm going to fill these with um, the reinforced, you know, the window things. These things. Uh, let's go and research those, actually. I'm pretty sure we've got enough scrap. Okay, so there we... Oh, we get salvaged tools as well. That's good. Strengthen glass window. So we might as well... Ooh, locker. 350 for locker. I have 580. I'm going to do that. Large furnace as well. Might as well. All right. 105 scrap left. We just nuked all of it pretty much. But now we have some really cool BPs. How do you make a locker? Is that it? 50 metal frags and... Uh, 100 metal frags and 50 wood. That seems very cheap. Uh, we'll make two lockers. And um, we'll fill those lockers automatically, I think. One can go... Well, one upstairs next to a bed. Alrighty. And I'll pipe that up. So that'll be automatic. And that'll filter like stuff from the base uh it will put guns and stuff in there i'll have one on the roof as well i think not on the roof but in here maybe we'll have one downstairs as well i need at least two right could buy a cauldron conveyor so splitter conveyor and then in here i'll be like uh want a thompson uh hazmat uh we'll have one of each pistol ammo 128 medical syringe have six of those uh and then other guns just in case we haven't got thompson's you know custom smg uh apply this will be pistol bullets the upstairs will be um five five and we've got a couple of combiners to combine all of the output from the boxes it's one box number two number three i have to plug it into a combiner each way like if you have more than three boxes so we'll just plug the other box which i think is over here actually is it this one? Yeah, this is like got stuff in it. Uh, let me get another storage adapter. And plug all that into my conveyor. Output into the splitter. And that goes into each locker. And I need to power this thing. Do we have pass through? Um, I need to pass 10. That on? Yeah, turn on. So that should, in theory, start bringing some stuff into our lockers. Give it a sec. Oh, there you go. Nice. All right, cool. We haven't got any meds actually crafted, so that's why that hasn't worked. Um, but yeah, hazies and guns is the locker. And I could I could probably just pass this out straight up to the upstairs locker, but I want to change the upstairs for 5.5 five guns instead of, like, pistol. So we need another... Have I run out of metal frags? And this one up here will be, like... Uh so like metal face mask roadside jacket roadside kilt pants medical syringe uh assault like ak semi-rifle and then five five uh, 128 okay should work and then we take this downstairs it's kind of awkward getting the piping downstairs or like through the base because of how they updated it you know uh and then we need to power that conveyor so i will take pass through on here straight up here bum 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 uh, give it a second should start seeing some stuff there we go nice we don't have any, actually have any five five crafted yet or like any full kits and stuff but it's just going to use everything from around the base like every box so if we depot any kind of armor like we didn't do coffee can, did we? So we go down here and depot some armor. It will take it if it needs it. So it will take that coffee can. Bye bye. Bye bye now. There you go. See? Uh, I think the next thing we should work on is the depot box. So the depot box is really quite simple. It's literally just a combiner. I mean, I suppose you want to filter stuff as well, right? So, so our box back here, that's obviously our components box. So if we put this here, you can change the filter to components. But you have to add laptop and camera. It doesn't take those. Uh, laptop. What's it called? Computer. Targeting computer. There you go. 
Uh, and that will just come from the outside box, the depot box. So this is our depot box. So do I, should I put it into a, yeah, I need to put that into a splitter. So let's go down here and I'll put the splitter on the ceiling. Cause it does, it like, depending on how many boxes you've got, it does get pretty damn hectic with the amount of splitters and stuff that you can have. Cause you can chain them forever. You can sort every, like if you wanted to, you could sort every individual item into their own box. There you go. And then we basically just go like, oh, we want this to be our gear box. So we do clothing. Nice. Now we even have to we have to power all these things. So I'm gonna use a different branch, I think. So if we take a bunch of clothing outside now, let's pretend we just did a roam, we killed somebody. Magic. Imagine if we did that, that'd be huge. <laughs> there we go, we depoted the box. It should just go bye bye into its respective box. Oh, ha. would help if you put. <laughs> yeah, so now it should just pop in. There you go. And components should work too. So let's take a bunch of components out. Bye bye. See? Sorts it all. Is that not awesome? <laughs> that's so good. I love it so much. This industrial update is the best thing that's ever happened to Russ. <laughs> okay. Now that's done. Uh, I kind of want to plug one to my TC just so like upkeep's definitely going in there. Sadly, it can't fit because the pipe is blocked no matter where I go because it's so close to the wall. Bit of an annoyance, but I suppose it is what it is. Uh, this is going to be guns and stuff, so we can probably sort that out right now. Weapons. Oh, we already have an in. Let's just add another one in. Ah, oh, we can't. And now because we've used up two of the slots, the third one needs to be put into another splitter. Uh, otherwise, it won't. We won't be able to extend even more. You know what I mean? So even if my base is completely closed up, I go outside, like to my depot box, and let's say I want to put in some clothes, some weapons. It's already gone. <laughs> Just zip, got away. It's pretty cool. Oh, I've leveled up to level ten. Nice. I wonder if that saw went in here. Yeah, it did. <laughs> That's so good. Okay, I've just crafted a bunch of ammo. 5-5 five, five ammo. I shouldn't matter where I put it. It should just take it into the upstairs locker. Yeah, it is. <laughs> so good. Oh, it's so cool. All right. I think that is actually going to be it for tonight. Uh, I've automated the entire base pretty much. We've got lockers, everything. I've got it set up to Rust Plus. So if we do get online raided, uh, we might be able to defend it. I don't know. Offline raided, sorry. We'll try. We'll try. I'm going to fall asleep upstairs naked so if they do kill me then um yeah fingers crossed we survive the night well, all right it looks like we haven't been raided uh, it is decaying but that's fine we haven't been raided that's what matters i think today's goal is to set up the uh heli tower or the heli bit upstairs because i want to try and take heli i think that's going to be crazy on here uh, and maybe we do some oil rigs and stuff. And let's... Oh, why is power off? Oh, no. Did our windmill decay? Oh, no. I didn't put enough in the TC. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, I think the windmill decayed. Well, that's actually kind of a good thing. Because I wanted it to be higher anyway. <laughs> let's go have a look. Oh, yeah. It's gone. It's gone, though. <laughs> that's fine. Okay. Uh, all right. Let's go do a quick little farm run and get back into it. Oh yeah, there we go. Everything back on. That's nice. All the automation should be ready now. It should be back working. There we go. All right. Okay, hey, everything's back up and running. Uh, I do need to repair my base a little bit. <laughs> I, I kind of forgot it about decay. I'm not gonna lie. Thought I had enough. Okay, let's let that all smelt. Um, yeah, that'll eventually smelt through. Uh, I did I research the window bar last night? I did, didn't I? Yeah, so I need quite a few metal frags to do that. While that's smelting, I might as well go and do oil or something. Yeah, let's go try and do oil to get some C4 to try and do one of the banks. 
still don't have any cloth for meds. That is actually a problem. I don't have meds in my lockers. Take those for now. There we go. Got fuel. Let's go. Oil. Oh, there's a scientist right here. Uh oh. For any more. Wait, has this been done? Red room's not open. Where's all the loot? <laughs> oh shit. Uh, I'm a bit confused. Uh, not gonna lie. There's like no loot here, which is weird. Ooh. That's a nice box. Oh, so is that. Damn. This isn't good. I was expecting way more meds. Oh, I completed a quest. Nice. Does that mean I got any points? Uh, quests. I got 20 points. Does that mean I can get anything? Not really. <laughs> okay, should we just try and do the heavies? What's the worst that could happen, eh? <laughs> Did not kill them all? What the f Bloody hell. It should be alright. This pan, the pot helmet, like, is so overpowered at rig. It really is. Kind of makes it easy. Yeah. Holy crap, that took my health down. How much left on the crate? Oh, four minutes. All right, we cleared that pretty fast. Not bad. Should we call the airdrop? I'm scared the airdrop's going to fall not on rig, and I won't be able to get it. So I'm going to call it at home, I think. Oh, crate unlocked. Come on. Give me something decent. I need the yams. Give me something good. Come on. <laughs> what, is it, what, is it, what is it? Another air... Okay, a rocket launcher. All right. I mean, I'll take that. Another airdrop. Pretty cool. What do I drop? I'm not gonna use M M &Rs. Ah, that. Don't need the stone wall. All right, cool. That wasn't too bad. Let's bounce. I'm not getting very lucky with my rigs. I want to get like explosions, uh, explosives. You know. Let's get out of here. What the? What the fuck? Dude just rolled up on me. What the hell? Let's get the crap out of me. The AI on this server is weird. <laughs> it's really strange. I found a base on the way here. I marked it on the map at K10 that has a lot of potential. Uh, so I might might try and raid it. I don't think I've got enough to like fully complete the raid, but I might try and do something. 822 scrap. That was not bad. Let me show you this. Let's see if I can find it actually. I don't have how much low grade I have. 81. Oof. Mm, do I have time? It was over here somewhere. Here it is. This one here. I think there's turrets on the roof. Uh, on the floor. But there's no turret on the roof. And I, oh, there is a turret on the roof. Oh, okay. I changed my mind. I ain't dealing with turrets. Turrets suck. We should raid the roof campus from yesterday. Oh, shit. 
tree. Whoa, that was close. Ugh. Ah, my guys froze. What the fuck? Ah, we made it. Oh my, that was stressful. All right, let's get into our core, get the heater on. <laughs> that was very stressful. Okay, let's throw both these airdrops. That could be some explosives. 927 scrap. Rockets are tier 3, right? Pretty shocks. Rocket launch is tier 2. Rockets themselves are tier 3, I believe. Yeah, you got instant and normal, but... Okay. How much scrap do we have? 927. Alright. How much explosives? We've got so much sulfur. We should just craft GP. Okay, so for 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 K GP. Having the auto smelter smelt for you, like and do the charcoal is so cool because you just always have charcoal available and playing a solo charcoal is like very annoying to get uh but we got it so that's good so now i need to focus on getting rope so i think i might even have to go farm the road so i don't have any rope i got eight well no okay 18 foot that's actually not bad uh do we have any cloth we do not have any cloth that is a problem is that Explorer Ammo Tier 3? It is, isn't it? How far away? We're only 500 scrap away from a Tier 3. And then to research it, I think... Is it 500 scrap? Well, oh, no. Is it, is it 125? 125. Okay, so if I go do a quick outpost run and recycle all the comps in the base, we might have enough to make a Tier 3. And then we could make Explo Ammo plus Satchels to raid like as many people as we can yeah let's gather up all the comp components and go to outpost how much low grade is in the mini 34 and outpost is oh it's only right there that should be fine <laughs> that should should be fine Twenty-two tech trash. What? Twenty-eight tech trash. Bruh. Okay. I need to buy some food. Where's the food guy? Let's just go. One. What are you looking at? You can't take my mini. Ha ha ha. Tack gloves. Five hundred. There you go. I'll buy one of those. Recycle it. Alright. Uh, oh, I need low grade as well. Duh. Okay, that'll do. 600 low grade. Let's bounce. Oh, it's outside. Oh, that was a mistake. That was a mistake. Oh. <laughs> Please be good loot in these airdrops to make <laughs> make up for that. <laughs> ah, <laughs> come on. Oh, sheesh. Wait. He had a very, very expensive gun. No idea. That sucks. Ow. My hand drops suck on me. <laughs> Maybe I'm just getting unlucky. Okay, so for scrap, we have 2000. So I can make a tier 3. So that's going to be pretty cool. Level 3. Very cool. Level 12. What can we get? Phone. XP rewards. So much stuff. Will this here free fit here? Do I have to move this auto turret? That's very annoying. Level 3. Ooh, it's a big boy. Oh, nice. 
All right, now I can craft X blow ammo, which is n no wait, I didn't research it. Where is it? Nice. Okay. Do we have anything on the tier three tech tree? I don't think we do. Everything's super expensive as well. Raiding is what two thousand scrap. AK is twenty five hundred. Bolt is three thousand. HMLMG is two thousand. Yeah, it's kind of a it's kind of a stretch. But now we can craft explo ammo, which is what is what does it take? Metal frags, GP, and sulfur. Damn, we can craft a whole stack. That's two doors. Two stacks. Three stacks. Four stack. Wait, what does it say? You are not allowed to craft this item. You're joking. Why can you craft all the others and you can't craft the explo ammo? Just ah, what the hell is that? Oh, I guess satchels it is. It's gonna be very annoying. How are we gonna deal with that turret? That's the question. We could, could we flame? Could you flamethrower a turret? It's four hundred and twelve low grade. You can molotov it. Can I make molotovs? I can't. What is it? Tier two. You can satchel charge it. it. Takes two satchel charges, but I'm guessing that has to land directly on it, which is gonna be pretty damn hard. Fire arrows. I think we have those, don't we? Yeah, we can research that. We can already craft that. Wood and cloth. 10 low grade for two, and you need 46. That's a lot of low grade. 230 low grade. We've got well, 18 satchels so far, plus the satchels in by storage. We don't have any more rope. Okay, so that, uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and scout and see what we're dealing with with the roof campers. Uh, all the explosives are here. But 26 satchels. That's not bad. That's, that's not bad at all. Let's go scout and see what we can find. And I can make a few more if we need to. Alright, let's go. Uh, where did they live? It was like above Scrap Town, wasn't it? Yeah. Let's go around. I bought resources to put down a turret. Hell yeah. Take that. Oh, snow kit? That's sick. <laughs> Hell yeah. Okay, they should live somewhere around here. I'm pretty sure they do. I remember it being right above Scrap Town. Oh. That's not them, is it? That's a different base. It's kind of worrying, though. Wait, is that is that it there? I think that's the one. This one. Are they online? Is it? Oh, the shotgun trap. Is there still a turret? That's what I want to know. I mean, can I build? Oh, if I could build here, that'd be crazy. Building block. Oh, landmines. What the hell? <laughs> oh, they put landmines on the ridge. That's crazy. Can I walk past this without setting it off? Please, please. Oh, I'm scared. Okay. Oh. They've put landmines on the entire... I guess that's, that's kind of smart. That's fair fair play. How am I going to get out of here? Okay, turret. Okay, yeah, there's a turret like behind here. I can build, but like kind of far back. Hey, they haven't got a door there. Have they already been raided? I can hear the turret. Oh, the turret's... Oh, the turret's behind...